and welcome back to the channel. My name's Nicola if you're new here. Right, let's get on with this video. So, first video back after Christmas. Hope you've all had a lovely time and as minimal pain as possible. <laughs> um, I will catch you up on all of my Christmas in a minute. I'm filming this the day before New Year's Eve, um, which is Friday. So I thought I would just run you through a few of my presents, not all of them, but a few of them, and a couple of things of what I've ordered recently. Um, and then I'll catch you up on my Christmas. So if that sounds good to you, stay tuned. Right, the first thing that I got given by my friend Donna, <laughs> you might to see these, are a pair of light up gonks. Look at this. <laughs> a pair of light up Christmas gonks. And she also bought me a sign um, that says, Wizards welcome, muggles tolerated. That's a phrase from Harry Potter, if you didn't know. So that was the first thing that I got. Let's turn them back off. Put them down there for a minute. Right. Oh, I got this lovely candle. Can't go wrong with a candle, can you? From Mark's mum and dad. Um, this was in my stocking. White Christmas is called. It's been burning by my bedside cabinet, so I've already burnt some of it um, over Christmas. So that was very nice. You can't go wrong with a scented candle with me. You just can't. Um, Holly got me this from my Christmas Eve box, which is the lipstick that I use, the Maybelline Matte Ink Superstay. And this is in the shade Pioneer number 20, and it's the one I'm wearing today. I really love it. I love the reds for winter and Christmas. I just think, and I wore this lipstick on Christmas Day as well, and it lasted all day. Um, hang on, let me just reach behind me. So I also, we did a second Christmas day yesterday with um, Angela, Simon, Chloe and Luke. And well, it was Christmas evening because some of them were working. So we had another Christmas dinner, but we did beef and, tur beef and chicken instead of turkey. And it was lovely. Um, and Chloe and Luke bought me this Paint Your Own Fairy Garden and Fairies. I am so excited to be doing this. I am really excited to do that. So that will be done at some point. And while I'm doing it, <laughs> they bought me this. So it's like a little bottle of Rosé Prosecco and some chocolates at the bottom as well. So they said I could be having this while doing this. But I think if I did that, then this would turn out to be a disaster. But I said, there's a vlog for you. There's a vlog for you right there. Craft drunk. <laughs> drunk craft. <laughs> what do you think? Let me know in the comments below. Shall I do a drunk craft? Um, Holly wrote me this. So... Happy Christmas, Mother. <laughs> we are going to Kensington Palace and then having a champagne afternoon tea. Love you so much. P.S. Sorry the printer wouldn't work. <laughs> Love, Holly. So she wrote this out for me. Um, so she's, yeah, she's taken me to Kensington Palace. I haven't been for a long, long time. The last time I went was with Mark. I think it was even before I got ill. So... Yeah, I'm really looking forward to that. And at the same time, she also bought Poppy and Mark um, a experience in the Crystal Maze thing in London. So she thought we'd book them all at the same time and then we can meet up like for dinner or something. Not that we'll want dinner if we've... In, you know what I mean, you know what I mean. Right, bring some things closer. Oh, this was my boxing day i've got a boxing day present from mark's mum and dad it's a pineapple off the shoulder sweatshirt i wore this yesterday and it's very very comfy but i do think i've left fluff everywhere so i think i need to put it in the wash actually <laughs> so yeah this was lovely and then mark's sister 
and her boyfriend bought me this lovely sort of jumper and blouse combination from um, Next. So it's got like that mock little blouse bit at the bottom. I just love the colours as well. Very, very me. And then also this one with the big collar. Hang on. Let's get it out. Let's get it out. Let's get it out. <laughs> I'll get there in a minute. I'll get there. Bear with. Bear with. Um, so this is like a... What colour would you say? That's a green? I think it's green. And then it's got this mock collar on it. So again, nice with jeggings or leggings. Either or. Um, Miss Angela. I had this lovely light up gonk. You put a tea light in there from Miss Angela and Simon. And I also had a zoo voucher. So I can get a, a gold card. That was from Mark's mum and dad. Um, it's what I asked for because I love the zoo so much. I love animals, as you know. And my favourite animal is the chimps. So, and the orangutan. <laughs> or orangutans, they've got two. So I am intending on using this when I've got a spare minute to go. And So be sure you'll be having plenty of zoo vlogs this year. So I hope you all like the zoo. <laughs> so obviously Mark got me my tattoo. It's healing well. This is a um, bow truckle from Fantastic Beasts, which is from Harry Potter. His little face is here. I don't know if you can... Can I get close enough for you to see? He's got a little face. Um, I absolutely love it. It is healing well. I've been putting the cream on. And yeah, I'm intending on from here on my arm down to my wrist i'm intending on this part of my arm being a montage of harry potter and fantastic beasts so the next one i'd like to get on here is the little niffler who takes all the coins and the jewels and then maybe a wand um, mischief managed with footprints i like that just a montage of harry potter and fantastic beasts and i absolutely love it so that was my present from from Mark. Um, what else? Did I, oh, Poppy bought me a new fairy house for the garden, and it's called Elfridges, <laughs> which I love instead of Selfridges. It's Elfridges, but it's pouring with rain. I was going to go and get it and show you, but I'm I'm not. <laughs> and my sister bought me a new. You know the book nook that I made um, that was. Nocturne Alley she bought me Diagon Alley so I've got that kit to make as so it'll be another vlog for you um so I've got that kit to make as well but that takes quite a while to make those kits but I absolutely love it um and I also got a whole big bag of candle soya wax because I'm going to start making my own candles this year more vlogs <laughs> I'm not all just doing this for vlogs, I'm doing this just because I want to do it, you know. But obviously I will show you at the same time. Um, there's probably other stuff that I got. Let me show you some stuff that I bought myself um, recently. So I went to Aldi's to get some shopping yesterday. And I found this. So these are knockoff Joe Malone perfumes from Aldi's. This is number 39 poppy and barley and it was 6 99 and when I tell you oh, I could spray some on it smells divine absolutely divine it reminds me of a perfume that I, I have used in the past but for the love of me I can't remember what it was but I really recommend that one the poppy and barley one I don't like all of their perfumes their Joe Malone knockoffs but that one I love um i've also i wanted because new year's eve we're going to angela and simon's and i wanted a really glittery eyeshadow um so i ordered this because it had good reviews can you see the glitter in there i don't know if that's picking that up or not but it's really glittery there if i hold it to the light and lovely colors as well but 
I tried it on my eye. I tried this one up here on my eyes this morning. There's no pigment of that colour. All it is is that glitter. It's just that glitter. So what you have to do is put an eyeshadow underneath and then rub your finger and sort of press it on your eyelid. So that's how I'm going to do it. But I was a bit disappointed because I wanted it to be an actual eyeshadow with glitter in. Um, and if you've got any that are good, can you list them in the comments below and recommend them to me? But that was um, 6 .99. And then I was recommended this mascara, um, which is from Essence Eye Heart Extreme Crazy Volume Mascara Waterproof. So I bought this because my mascara needed replacing. The last mascara I used was Revolution and it was very good actually. Um, it was about 8 99 that mascara. This one was 5 99 from Amazon. Uh, and I used it this morning. It's okay, you know. It's, I haven't found a mascara that I'm like, wow. I've not found a mascara like that yet. But it's a mascara. It does the job. Now I catch up on my Christmas so and how I was so Christmas Day uh, Christmas Eve Christmas Day I was absolutely fine had a nice day um, the thing I will tell you is that the when was it the Friday before Christmas my mum had was had to go to A&E um, mum my mum and dad both had Covid and my mum has arthritis and she had to have some antiviral med medication while she had COVID and she was ex experiencing extreme stomach pain. So she went to A&E and they scanned her and found that her bowel, part of her bowel had ruptured, like um, perforated, that's it, perforated bowel. So she had to have keyhole surgery to fix it. But when they went in, um, they found like quite a large section of bowel had died that they had to remove and give her a stoma bag. So she's, but she's got that for about four months and then it can be reversed. So that's good, just while it's healing really. Um, so she was in an hospital all over Christmas. We went to see a Boxing Day um, before we went to Mark's mum's. Boxing Day, I was shattered. Oh, let's go back. So the anti the reason I said about the antiviral medication she had to take for COVID was because that can cause bowel problems, and she had bowel problems anyway. So I think it just tipped it over the edge. Um, but yeah, Boxing Day, I was absolutely shattered because we hosted Christmas Day, and I was just so tired, so tired. And also I think with filming and editing Vlogmas is quite a lot and I loved it but you you have that come down afterwards you're like oh I'm exhausted um, so yeah Boxing Day I was really tired but we went to see my mum and then we went to Mark's mum's and had a lovely day there um, the day after that was Mark's mum's birthday so we went to his sister's <laughs> I did think I'm not going to make this I'm not going to make this day but I did I managed to do it and then the day after that we went to our friend John and Tilly's and then yesterday I went to Aldi's and then prepped all ready for last night so and then today I am literally filming this and then I'm going to have a rest I'm going to catch up on some YouTube that I want to watch and just rest and tonight we're going to go and see um, Matilda the musical at the cinema so we're going to go, there's me and Mark, Holly and Poppy and Lisa, Mark's sister. So we're all going to go and do that. So that would be nice. Um, and then tomorrow's New Year's Eve and we are going to Mark's, uh, Mark's, we are going to Angela and Simon's as we always do New Year's Eve. We have like a buffet, we play games, we do the sparklers and so if you follow me on Instagram and Facebook you'd probably have seen all that <laughs> all that goodness um, yeah and then New Year's Day we're just going to relax but I think tomorrow we're going to take all the decorations down I've started taking a few bits down today 
um but i i just feel like i want to go into the new year with a clean fresh bungalow and i am filming it so like a speed clean video for you which will be the next one um up after this one okay so what we're doing is you'll have this one now then you'll have the speed clean and taking the christmas decorations down then we go away for holly's birthday for her 21st so i will film that and upload that the following wednesday and then it will be back to the weeklies so hope that's okay that's just how it's worked out talking about future for the fu for this channel this year i intend on still filming weeklies if that's okay with all of you um i like filming the weeklies and i think everybody enjoys watching the weeklies wednesday vlogs i have decided not to pressurize myself on them because it was really hard getting two uploads a week when you you know you're not well yourself so what i'm doing is if i do put a wednesday upload out it's out there if i don't it will be um saturday for the weekly okay so that's that's my plan for this channel this year and i hope you're all okay with that um and if there's any videos you'd specifically like me to film then please let me know in the comments i've been fighting off a cold thing uh when did i start oh probably oh it's when we went to john and tilly's i didn't feel well and i thought oh i really just could do the down the sofa but i don't i hate letting people down i know tilly had gone to all the trouble of you know preparing a um table and the food for us so i didn't want to let anyone down so i've been taking first defense spray and that's really helped so far um <coughs> <clears throat> but it's still catching me in my throat today when I'm talking to you. Anyway, I hope that you all had a good Christmas. I hope your pain lasted out and you didn't have too many flare-ups. Um, and got lovely things. Enjoyed yourselves. <laughs> and let's go into this new year in 2023. Positivity, happiness, health, everything like that. That is what I'm intending on doing. I am really looking forward to 2023. I don't know why. I just am. I have this feeling it's going to be a good year. So fingers crossed that it is. Um, love you all lots. Thank you for watching. Give it a thumbs up. And I'll see you all in the next one. Bye.